What is mass transfer in chemical engineering? If you're curious about how substances move from one place to another in chemical processes, you're asking the right question. Let's break down what mass transfer is all about. Mass transfer is essentially the study of how a component moves from one phase to another or within the same phase from a region of high concentration to a region of low concentration. This can happen in various phases, such as between a gas and a liquid, or even within a solid. Imagine you have a mixture of different substances and you need to separate them. Mass transfer operations are crucial for this. For example, if you have a liquid with dissolved gases, mass transfer helps in understanding how these gases move from the liquid to the air above it. The driving force behind mass transfer is the difference in chemical potential of the component in the different phases. Chemical potential is a measure that can be expressed using properties like concentration, pressure, and vapor pressure. When the chemical potential is higher in one phase than in another, the component will move from the phase with the higher potential to the one with the lower potential until they reach equilibrium. Mass transfer can occur through several mechanisms such as diffusion, absorption, and convective mass transfer. Diffusion is the process where molecules move from areas of high concentration to areas of low concentration. This is described by Fick's first law, which gives us the molar flux of a component based on its concentration gradient. Absorption, on the other hand, involves the transfer of a solute from a gas or liquid phase to the surface of a solid or another liquid phase. This process is often described using the mass transfer coefficient, which helps in calculating the rate of mass transfer. Convective mass transfer is similar to convective heat transfer and involves the movement of mass due to the flow of fluids. This can happen in various types of operations, such as in distillation columns, where fluids are flowing in opposite directions, countercurrent flow, or in the same direction, co-current flow. Mass transfer operations are vital in chemical engineering because they are used in almost every chemical process. Whether it's purifying raw materials or separating products from byproducts, mass transfer is essential. Examples of mass transfer operations include distillation, extraction, leaching, and drying. These operations can be quite complex and often involve chemical reactions, making the understanding and modeling of mass transfer crucial for designing and optimizing these processes. In summary, mass transfer in chemical engineering is about understanding how substances move between different phases or within the same phase, driven by differences in chemical potential. It's a fundamental concept that underpins many critical processes in the field.